Did you know sharks both in the wild and in captivity can actually develop severe cases of scoliosis? This so this viral video is going around of Stella the sand tiger shark that had surgery in August of 2020 in Mississippi for scoliosis. Of course, being the spine nerd that I am, I had to do a little bit more digging for you, and this is her preoperative x-ray where basically she had a slippage of her vertebrae. Now without surgery, her prognosis was very grave and she was going paralyzed, so they decided to attempt to repair her spine. And you may wonder, how would you do surgery on a shark? Well, this is how. They intubated the shark to keep her oxygenated, and they kept wet towels on her skin to keep her hydrated during the procedure. Now, during her first operation, what they did was they exposed the spine, and they plated either side of the spine to try to stabilize it. Now, reportedly, she was swimming better than before surgery within hours after that surgery. Uh, however, over a period of about five months, her deformity started to come back, and she became weak again. Repeat imaging showed this, that her hardware was loosening up, and her deformity was worse. Now, reportedly, they were worried about this going into the surgery because sharks don't have bones like human. Their bones is like cartilage, so they were concerned that the orthopedic hardware may not hold or may not stay. So she underwent a second salvage operation, which is what you see here with longer plates, and the surgery was somewhat challenging. Unfortunately, Stella succumbed to postoperative complications after the surgery and passed away.